this mask you wanna i just can't rooibos sunscreen i absolutely love it <laughs> Hey, it's Gail and welcome to the channel. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel and comment down. So today we're going to talk about what exactly every feminine woman needs in her handbag. What are the top five things that you cannot live without? Things that you can leave the house with, things that you need on a daily in your handbag. And also, what is it that you don't keep in your handbag and is so why? So just kindly comment down below and let's tell the girls in the back who are watching. And also, is in my handbag, what do I carry, what I don't. And yeah, so basically, it depends also if it's a work handbag and where you're going to. It's basically what the occasion is. I don't think you're going to carry the same stuff. Let's see it like that in the same handbag, depending on where you're going. It's not gonna work like that. So yeah, can you like this video? I'm actually gonna give you guys two seconds to like this video, just two. There we go. Comment down below, like I said, what are the top five essentials that you carry in your handbag, what you cannot go without, what you cannot live without, and what you also just don't like in your handbag, what you don't put in there, and also why. So without any further ado, let's get right into this hand. Let's get right into this handbag. Let's get right into this video. First things first. I know every woman, guys, we have the most prettiest handbags, beautiful, looks expensive, probably is expensive, but hey, if I'm gonna be honest with women, <laughs> that bag could look really bougie and nice or whatever, but the minute you go in there, organizing our bags, is, it has to be the biggest problem we have. I'm not speaking for all women, but majority, if we're being honest, it's never, it's never a good sight in there. Like things are just scattered everywhere. You can find shoes in there, <laughs> like flats or heels. You also find scattered candy, gum in there. And then you also find coins like scattered in the handbag. That is not healthy. That is not feminine. I'm so sorry. You cannot do this. Guys, I'm sorry about the toilet pot in the back seat. The bathroom has the best lighting and there's nothing I can do. So please excuse me. But anyways, what I was saying is that the good on the outside, but on the inside is another whole thing. But anyways, where's your handbag? <laughs> so this is my handbag. I love this burnt orange color. It's so pretty. Love, 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 love. So this is not my work handbag. This is just a casual bag that I carry if I'm going out or somewhere. I absolutely love this. Everything that you see in this video, I'm going to actually put it in the description. And something I realized is you guys don't read the description. That is where everything is always. So I'm gonna put where I bought my rings, my necklace, everything that you see in this video, I'm gonna put it in the description. So guys, please, read the description it always has everything you want i'm not always going to mention everything in the video but yeah so this is my handbag if you want to find out who it's from in the description i'm going to put it on the screen somewhere in case some people don't know what it is or where to find it so this is basically my handbag i think i should give you guys a tour as well but yeah what are my top Five essentials that I keep in my handbag. First thing that I keep in my handbag is obviously my iPhone. Can't live without my iPhone. I just can't. So this is one thing that I obviously carry around. Although I do not carry my phone in my handbag because I'm just so scared. Like, what if someone grabs my handbag and my phone's gone as well? So I always try to put it either like in my you know, I know it's so big, but it fits, or just in my pants or something, but I do not carry my phone in my handbag. So this is the first thing I carry in my handbag, my iPhone. It's an iPhone 12 Pro Max. My iPhone is actually gold. I'm filming with my iPhone, so I'm using someone's iPhone as display. I use it to do everything. I use it to create content. I use it to make money. I use it to plan my daily routines. I use it for pictures, literally everything. I'm not even gonna lie, I'm always with my phone, I'm always on my phone. And 
yeah so this is the number one thing i cannot live without a day cream i always do that so you can what do you call it again what do you call it um sun sunscreen basically yeah so i have this rooibos sunscreen that i keep in my handbag i'm not sure if you guys can see it but it's this yes i love rooibos it's so moisturizing and is i think sp f15 so it kind of protects you from uv rays like at a 93 percent and i think spf 30 is at 97 and then 50 is 98 i'm not sure about the other two but i know this protects you 93 percent from the uv rays so i love love rooibos if you know me this is my girl this is my brand you want to know what it is description where did i find it it will be in the description so yeah this just basically protects me when i'm out there like especially for people who work in the fields or who go out more like me i always put this on every day to protect my skin from the burns because when i get burns they are ugh, out of this world so yeah this is the second thing that i always have in my handbag my sunscreen now the second thing is i'm sorry i cannot even say this this is something we should all have hand cream again it's rooibos how are you a lady and you do not have hand cream in your bag no guys i love this hand cream it's a hand and nail cream it's so moisturizing i feel like it has glycerin in it, glycerin in it or something love it so it has vitamin e in it it has chamomile i love chamomile so i always carry this with me now listen guys just because i have hand cream doesn't mean it's a community property please buy it you don't listen you don't have it because you don't want it so don't ask it from someone else okay so i always carry this baby with me sometimes it's not roy boss sometimes it's another brand mostly also having as well but this is the third essential thing that i carry in my handbag i love it. it smells good moisturizing and just everything absolutely in love with this now the third thing that i carry in my handbag mascara i don't really use it i mean if i'm going somewhere i'm gonna use it once i'm not gonna really do it again but i normally like it to cool my brows so my, my brows are not done so it's this mascara essence mascara love it the volume that i get from this is insane but i haven't used it though yeah i am going to still put this in the description for you guys to just know where i got it from so yeah if you've made it this far into the video kindly like this video and again comment down below what it is that you carry every video why you do it and why you don't carry the other stuff that you probably don't a lipstick red lipstick this is what i'm wearing on so i made it ombre with like a black lip pencil so i always have this with me i don't really put it on but i always have it with me you know but you wouldn't find it in my work handbag only in my casual handbag and then the third thing i have is gloss i mean who does not have gloss gloss i'm sure every girl has gloss this is not even a for debate i love gloss but one thing i don't love about gloss is the stickiness because once you put it on you go out there and it's windy dust sand particles already on your lips I don't, this, that, that's just one of the cons i hate cons i don't like about um lip gloss but other than that this is my lip gloss i absolutely love it i'm in love with it and yeah always carry my gloss the only and the fact that it gives you that instant glow that shiny and shimmery one i think it has to be my favorite part of it but the stickiness no so kindly comment down below where i can get non sticky lip glosses because i can't deal mm -mm. moving on moving on moving on moving on moving on sunglasses these are not a glasses that i just wear everywhere these are basically reading glasses because like i said i do basically everything on my phone i have ibooks and i read with my glasses because the words are a little bit too small and the fact that i'm just always like squinting my eyes 
is not okay with me. So I always have this in my bag because I read a lot on my iPhone. Literally everywhere. I read everywhere. I could be reading at work, like just two minutes. I could be reading when it's lunchtime, when I'm in the bathroom, literally everywhere. So I always have this in my handbag. Like I said, women are not so organized. <laughs> that is why you need this essential like tiny bag where you like especially if your handbag doesn't have compartments i feel like you should get yourself these where i keep all my jewelry i used to like toss my jewelry in my handbag just everywhere and i lose the stoppers and i used to be so annoyed looking for it so now i have this pretty pretty bag i'm gonna put it in the description where i bought it so maybe you guys can go buy it as well so this is where i keep all my jewelry in my handbag so this is where i keep my earrings and just everything is in here so that i don't have i know exactly where to go in my handbag and not mess it up looking for something so i keep all my jewelry in this pretty 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 bag <laughs> and yeah girl 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 essentials i always have this in my bag funny thing is i never carry pads in my handbag because i feel like even if i was to start it's not going to be that fast like the first maybe a few hours so i always have what are these panty liners in my handbag <laughs> i always always have panty liners in my handbag for emergency moments cortex you know where to get cortex guys i don't even have to put this in the description right so i always have this in my handbag <clears throat> Now the next thing I always have is what well, are sticker notes. Sometimes you're waiting in line and you just have nothing to do. Like you're on your phone, you're so bored. So what do you do? You just want to write a few things. Maybe you want to write a few things that you're gonna buy the following month and stuff like that. So I always carry these sticker notes with me. One thing that you cannot have in your handbag is your wallet. You cannot toss your coins in the handbag in your handbag just like that that is not hygienic it's not feminine it's not okay okay so i got this really cute wallet i got it last year i think like i said in the description you'll know where i got it from so yeah this is where basically all my cards are my coins my cash and everything i won't even lie i get lazy sometimes i just want to toss the change in the bag and it's not okay but this is my wallet i'm sure you watching this also have a wallet so yeah this is basically my wallet and it's quite big sometimes you find people with the small ones which are so cute for the handbag but i don't know for me i just really love the old standard type of design so <laughs> this is my wallet keep everything in here it makes life easier for me like i also keep my slips and just everything in this wallet i can't fit my whole cotton bag in my handbag so i just always like like stack up a few in case i'm sweaty or i just want to refresh or something i always have my cotton as well in my handbag right i mean well here in namibia we, the, we we don't wear mask anymore but i always have my mask love this mask you want to know where it's from in the description guys i love it because i don't have to wear the surgical mask that are always running the girls drip outfit mm -mm. love this mask for me guys i absolutely love it like i can wear anything and my outfit is still gonna be bomb you know the minute you put on that blue surgical mask ugh, it just ruins everything so this is my mask it's covid stay protected guys don't forget to like this video <laughs> my lip pencil i always carry this with me around just to fill in my brows and my eyeliner literally well my under eye and that's basically it what is in my handbag so we've come to the conclusion of this video comment down below honestly what you keep in your handbag what what you don't and why as well as to why you do why you don't and don't forget to like this video so for me gail it's 
Bye guys. <laughs>